Hello, this is Pavlos from Laravel Daily, and I want to invite you to my new course on Eloquent called Eloquent Expert Level. Now, uh, while working with Laravel for five years or so, I noticed that Eloquent is the most important part because it's really widely used and a lot of questions appear. So how do I optimize this and that? How do I do this and that in Eloquent? Or I've seen people using some complex structures or additional classes instead of doing uh, instead of using eloquent using some one magic property which they don't know or is not documented so i've decided to put out a course with a lot of details on eloquent it's 4 hours of videos uh, on eloquent alone it's 39 lessons uh, in 7 sections so let's briefly go through that here's the course outline the, the list of lessons so in section 1 is uh, section 1 is about various options and settings that you can have in your eloquent models so how to generate models with additional flags like uh, artisan make model minus m what would do minus c minus r or minus a uh, fillable and guarded is also important and also eloquent has a lot of properties like you can specify whether to use timestamps created at updated at whether to use soft deletes what fields are date format and what is the date format and a lot of that stuff. So that's section one. Section two is about creating and updating records. And it's, uh, again, Eloquent has a lot of hidden features or more convenient ways to do that. So instead of uh, checking, for example, instead of checking whether the records uh, exist and then inserting that, you can use first or create function. Then you can use seeds and factories for setting like dummy data, fake data for testing using faker. Uh, and then there's a lot of methods and properties in Eloquent which are not that well documented or not widely known. So that's section number two. Section number three is probably the most important and the most often uh, asked in Laracast's forum or on the internet in general. How do I optimize and query effectively? Uh, and uh, the queries are basically the question is how do I transform SQL query into eloquent and there are a lot of again kind of hidden gems so for example how do you put and or like more complex query with a lot of uh, brackets with a lot of uh, conditionals how do you do that in eloquent uh, basically how to transform a few sentences from SQL into one uh, eloquent query and do that effectively possibly using raw queries where needed, how to sort the relationships, for example, this lesson is about ordering by relationships, uh, so order by and sort by is pretty different functionality uh, as it appears. So that's section number three. Section number four is about eloquent collections, so you need to know a lot of uh, functions, uh, what can you do basically with eloquent results. So you do eloquent query, then you do get, and with that get, you can do a lot of magical things like filtering, mapping, uh, like grouping, a lot of calculations, even even use DD on that, uh, die, dump and die. So I will talk about that in this section. Section number five is also important and widely used is relationships. One of the most uh, often questions I see online is, what type of relationship should I use? How to um, how to form that relationship? Should it be many to many? Should it be polymorphic? Should it be uh, like what what type of relationship and how to query that? Uh, I will talk about that. How to query pivot tables, for example. How to effectively then create or retrieve the records within relationships. So everything about advanced relationships is in section five. Section six is about eloquent performance, which is also really important because uh, a lot of people use eloquent, uh, use its kind of magic, the thing I uh, I call, but don't really see what's happening under the hood. And oftentimes uh, they call too many SQL queries or uh, query the database ineffectively, which really affects the performance. Uh, so what is slower, why it is slower, and what eloquent queries make your application slow, that is the topic of section six. Section seven is kind of a bonus one, is packages for extending eloquent, packages that I've used myself with my projects and uh, with my team. And I totally recommend that. Three out of six belong to Spati team. And uh, 
uh, like the most probably wide known uh, team for creating packages. They recently celebrated 20 million downloads for their packages. So that's probably why they're here, uh, half of this section. And then some other uh, vendors and some other packages. Probably the most uh, uh, widely used again is Laravel translatable for multilingual uh, models in Eloquent. And final, final section is a mini project, like practical thing. Uh, I'll, I'll be creating a mini blog, which took me two hours, and I've compiled that into 18 minutes of video. And I will use a lot of that functionality with advanced eloquent I've uh, shown in the previous lesson. So if you want to dive deeper into eloquent and become an expert in that field and query the database effectively, I invite you to this course where I will answer your questions. If you have one, you can comment on the lessons or find me online and ask more questions. I'll be your kind of instructor for those four hours. Uh, in that lesson. I hope it helps and I hope my time spent on that will be useful for, for generations to come in Laravel.